Hi, everybody. Uh, before we show you the new segments we produced this week, here are several announcements. Um, we have from the Holyoke Parks and Recreation Department, there will be a drive into Springfield event on March 28th. The rain date is April 3rd. Uh, so wave to the Easter Bunny, the Paw Patrol characters, Nick's Nest Hot Dog, and more surprises. Music will be provided by the 413 Family Fitness. Collect an Easter gift bag for children 12 and under while supplies last. This is going to be happening at the community field off Cherry Street. And it's for Holyoke re uh, residents and it's free. So that's our March 28th. That's coming up. Also, the city of Holyoke has waived some license fees. I'm going to read here from a press release from City Hall. As part of an effort to help businesses in Holyoke cope with the ongoing restrictions due to the pandemic, the City of Holyoke's License Board, with encouragement of Mayor Morse, has waived the following license fees for the 2021 season. Restaurant, all alcohol, and wine and malt. Hotel, innkeeper, all alcohol, and wine and malt. Clubs, all alcohol. Veterans Club, all alcohol. Common, Victualler, Vic, Victualler. Entertainment, automatic amusement devices. So any businesses seeking to renew these licenses for the 2021 season will not have to submit a license fee. For businesses that have already submitted payment for these fees, the city will return those payments to the business. Waiving fees is just one small effort to help local businesses. Utilizing federal community development block grants, the city, in partnership with the Greater Holyoke Chamber of Commerce, has also established a small business grant program to assist local businesses in these uncertain times. And if you have any questions, call City Hall for more information. Also, uh, Walgreens is has this Expressions Challenge, which is a creative arts and competition in three categories, including the visual arts, video production, and spoken word. Teens are guided to use time spent working on their creations as outlets for expressing difficulties they are facing. Students' finished works often address the range of issues from bullying and self-image to the rapid spread of HIV. Teens today still face these circumstances and more, and for many, their anxieties are compounded by the effects of COVID-19. Expressions was created for moments like these. Our country is dealing with the weight of a pandemic that has been so challenging that one can only imagine how young people must feel, said John Stanley, a president of Walgreens. This year, the program includes a specialty award category for submissions that explore the impact of COVID-19. The lucky winner of this category will receive $1,000 for the best entry that addresses the effects of the pandemic and the importance of getting vaccinated. For more information, we're going to include a link that you can click on and then get everything you need to, to find out how you or your youth can enter this competition. And finally, Hope Worldwide Pioneer Valley Chapter uh, presents Saturday Spark Academy. Saturday Spark Academy is a three-hour Saturday drop-off type program which seeks elementary, which seeks to help elementary and middle school aged children from underserved communities build resilience through trauma research and informed curriculum, healing arts, and special projects. The next session will be Saturday, it will be every Saturday starting in May and the first Saturday in June. Each session is from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Themes that will be covered are health, perseverance, friendships, self-control, problem solving, and goal setting. Uh, the location will be at the Nueva Esperanza main office at 401 Main Street in Holyoke. To get more information, contact Kathy Morgado at 413-427-9821. And we will also have information at the bottom of this video regarding that. Okay, if you are a nonprofit and you want to share information with the community of Holyoke, please send us an email at Holyoke Media. You can go to our website, holyokemedia.org, or through our social media pages.